here in this video i am just uh, giving you introduction actually uh, of electrostatics here is a device called gold leaf electroscope electroscope actually word is common scope anything to see to observe so electroscope is device which is used to check whether body charge or not and what type of charge is present on it it simply consists of uh, a metal disc which is connected to a metal rod the other end of the rod uh, <coughs> uh, connected with the two gold leaves gold means actually gold is good conductor of electricity and uh, it can be drawn in thinnest sheet you know so these thin sheet of gold are there this is metal disc this is metal rod this is uh, these are two gold leaves and this is glass container the glass container is used because glass is transparent so that we can see the leaves only glass purpose is there and glass is insulated also glass will have a insulator that is insulator also so any charge uh, can not get earth so when we touch a body and the leaves diverge away means they spread outward then we say that this body has charge if this body has electric charge because uh, just now i told you that two glass rod silk repel each other means like charge repel so when we uh, suppose this charge body to some charge get transferred to this this by conduction process and then by conduction of some charge will appear same charge will appear if it is negative charge then negative charge will come here so like charge repel the so if there is divergence of the two leaves then we say this body has a charge what type of charge present that is determined by other way in that case we keep the disc already charged suppose we have given some charge positive charge to it then a light small light charge so there will be small divergence in the gold leaves have we and when it is kept inside the glass container when we bring another uh, see rod after charging it if the <coughs> and we have charged positively we give slight charge to the metal disc and when we bring a body close to it having some charge then when we touch it some more charge may come or may be attracted if more charge if, if the uh, leaves further diverge it means this body has positive charge if they converge the divergence reduce means their spreading reduce then it has negative charge because negative charge reduce the charge of so this simple device uh, in one year exam it was asked what is gold leaf electroscope and describe in brief children do not study because actually we are in habit of learning important things we teacher also uh, keep on telling mathematics or physics actual physics is not generally taught in classrooms because uh, teachers have very little time in classroom and, and nobody interested in taking extra class and no child is interested in extra classes also both side problem is there so this is introduction you can see book also uh, for further details but it is an introduction to gold leaf electroscope now i come to next topic here uh, properties of charge i mean properties of charge properties of electric charge electric charge 
this chapter actually starting of class 12 in class 12 uh, electrostatic electricity magnetism electrodynamics uh, or then em wave or two em wave the topics are uh, lengthy and uh, not easily understood so you have to listen teacher very carefully and whenever you read a book read that carefully so first property is okay, electric charge is additive electric charge is additive additive means suppose you give plus 2 unit charge and then give plus 2 unit further charge the total charge you get become 4, no, four units I will discuss unit of charge later just now plus 2 charge units they have no charge and then plus 2 unit charge over there uh, you give uh, plus 2 unit plus, then total charge will be uh, 4 units now if you give plus 2 unit charge and minus 4 units then electric charge on what will be minus 2 units of charge so that means the charge is uh, additive now the second important property quantization of charge quantization your charge as a gear you can say like this charge is quantized because we are studying property Char electric charge electric charge is quantized what do you know quantized the word quantum confuses the student very much and throughout the student life person keep on thinking what is quantization and what is quantum better you see dictionary also now in your phone you have google though one day i was searching meaning of critical word critical so that was been wrong in Hindi, they were they were calling it as Gambhir. No, critical is the point of transition, line of transition, where things state get changed or <coughs> phenomena get changed. That particular point or particular line that is called critical may be there. Now, quantization means quantize. The word has derived from quantity quantity so electric charge quantized means the smallest possible charge the smallest possible charge the smallest possible electric charge i should say electric charge present in nature present in nature has magnitude of charge of electron which is that e small e is the magnitude of charge of electron small e wherever we write small e Electrode means we are writing charge of an electron and therefore electric charge electric charge on a body is found to be an integral multiple of E so if a charge body has charge plus Q then 
q is equal to n e where uh, n is number 1 2 3 where n is <coughs> n is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and so on. I talk about q, e charge, and magnitude of e is equal to 1.6 times the power 19 coulomb. Coulomb. So this is very small charge. I will tell you a problem here later on. Electric charge. But you know, is found to be integral or integral of E. But dear student, don't confuse with quantize ke multiple of any yoga. Any quantity we say quantize, does not it, it is n times some value. Maybe multiple of n, maybe multiple of one n, maybe multiple of one n n square. But multiple of some a uh, uh, smallest quantity there and a quantization quantum word has come from quantity just like in hydrogen atom we write energy is quantized and energy produced by electron in any anathorpic of atom minus 13.6 upon n square electron volt n is 1 2 3 so smallest energy of electron minus 13.6 then next higher value will be 13.5 by 4 minus 3.4 so these values of energy will be there only inside uh, possessed by electron in hydrogen atom in other atom it may be something other so don't get confused okay? when we say something is quantized some physical quantized then it will be multiple of any <coughs> number only it may be multiple of 1 upon n, may be multiple of 1 upon n square or any other number. Now, electric charge, the magnitude of electric charge of electron is 1.6 and about 19 minus 19 coulomb. This charge is very small. <coughs> so, quantization of electric charge is significant. We are talking about microscopic charges. Microscopic charge ke, uh, when we are studying micro charge then it is meaningful but when we are taking macroscopic charge means we are talking charge of one coulomb three coulomb then you know how many how many electrons should be taken off to give plus one coulomb charge to a body by like glass road get positive charge why because electron get detached on rubbing that is called frictional electricity when we rub glass road with silk, there appear friction, due to friction, electrons are removed and positive charge appear. So Q is equal to N. So Q is 1 coulomb and gamma it is 1.6 times power 19. So N will be here 1 upon 1.6 times power 19. It come out to be <coughs> 6.25. 10 to the power 18 electrons. This number is not small, very large. <coughs> so that way, quantization of charge is, has its significance only when we are talking about a small charge, charge of ions or charge of 2 proton or 10 proton, etc. But if this much number of electron charge should be taken, then quantization has no meaning. We will not be able to distinguish between two uh, charge, uh, uh, which have, have flow value. Now it was about electric charge, quantum charge. Now next properties: electric charge quanti uh, conserved. Third property: electric charge is conserved. Conserved. Actually, people are also not well known about the meaning of conservation. To conserve anything means to keep a thing as such. Conservation. I have asked many students 
and when I was student, I was very much uh, uh, worried about the meaning. But at that time, we were not uh, having the facilities that uh, uh, dictionaries are in hand. We we were not given dictionaries, so we have to go somewhere in library, etc. So hardly it took very long time to find. So conserve means conserve to keep a thing conserve means to keep thing to keep thing as such as such. When you want quantity direction or like uh, there is a department in India, soil conservation department means whatever the shape of soil is there, we have to maintain as such. We grow uh, trees on uh, hills so that the roots of the plants hold the soil together and uh, in rain or uh, in a dry season it does not go away. So electric charge conservation. It is now, now according to this electric charge can neither be created nor destroyed. You can write it yourself. It will take time because this has become lengthy. Electric charge can neither be created nor destroyed. It can be transferred from one to another. For example, when you rub glass road with silk, as much positive charge appears on glass road, the same negative charge will be on silk. So total charge zero. Before rubbing, the total charge on silk and glass roll was zero, and after rubbing, it is again zero. So this is the meaning of conservation. So thank you. We will come meet in next video.